today we are here to share our news about uh, the new land cover uh, map produced by the ISRI Impact Observatory and the Microsoft. And to share that update, we are here with a new video. video. So for that, first of all, we have to open a browser over here. As I have already opened. So uh, you have to simply go with this impact observatory and you can go to this impact observatory web page and here you can see it here empowering decision maker to a planetary super users news this we have to go to this news or this uh, we can find this or uh, in the living atlas too we can directly go with from there too you can uh, reach uh, to this site from different ways by typing different keywords in the browser uh, so after reaching this we can simply see it here about the data information how it was prepared and how it is going and about the data information 10 meter resolution map of earth land surface from 2020 2020 to 2021 january it contains the information about uh, one year and it is the, the best part of this uh, resolution is that it is the highest resolution data available publicly and prepared from the sentinel to data scene collection on the microsoft planetary computer processing over 4 lakh earth observation which is huge you can think about it little bit mm, you can see it here massive training data set are used here and uh, another thing is that it has a uh, output of 10 class map of the surface including vegetation type their surface crop in the urban areas and here you can see uh, on demand land cover map and enabling the entire gis community here and here you can see access the map from here to you can use web map to and you can use web map from the map viewer classic scene viewer or the rgis desktop you can see it here you can simply import your data to from your desktop or the computer pc or anything else for that what do we have to do is we have to save our file in a uh, zip and without making it heavy we can simply import it keeping the original features and it sometimes uh, so error or it uh, easily shows our data over here you can simply see it here it will take little bit time now we can go with these functions and we can simply clear that part and we have to provide this too and we can go with this we have to little bit increase this width and click ok and it will show us our part and like this way you can choose your area where it comes under you can simply uh, choose your area which you want to uh, extract or the download or you can simply here type your uh, place name or the area of interest zone and i am going to download the data of nepal so i am going to uh, use this so this is just a web map viewer uh, for downloading the data we have to go to uh, the application download index so before going to that i want to show you this open scene viewer too uh, you can see it here it takes little bit time to load you can see it looks like this and it is nothing or the similar thing uh, to that uh, map your classic but it has a little better visualization in terms of uh, alluring the people towards it you can simply see it and you can see the legend over here how many types of data it has a prepared class it has prepared output class it has 10 output class as it already mentioned then it has very viewer and it has very fine uh, data class to here you can see it here grass flooded vegetation it has this is very tiny information 
and with this you can use various uh, ways to view data visualization over here and you can save scene over here and you can see here the properties of the data or anything else so with this uh, visualization part uh, here i want to in the visualization part here so uh, now i want to go to the data download part and you can see it here in the living atlas arcgis part i am going to the end part and you can see going to this application that it mentioned i am going to that link and you can see it here land cover downloader map uh, website open and here it shows the data available geotip data of sardgb which we can download so we have to go to this section here you can see large number of box uh, you might think what kind of box is it and it is nothing other than a tile box uh, according to the datum region and here i am going to download data of my country nepal so for that uh, i want to provide a simple information on it is nepal comes under the two datum region that is 45 r and the 44 r so we have to download the datum of that region and in by going to the region uh, nepal region i am clicking on my nepal region is it contain two datum region so it will have two tiles over here so you can simply click here on the left click simple left click and it will take us to the download part and you can see it here download sin 44r as i have already downloaded it so i don't think i need to download it so i am cancelling it and you can simply go with like this 45r so i am going to simply download it and show you how to get it and as i have already downloaded it and i have previously mentioned it to so i don't think i need to download it so i am simply cancelling and with this we can download our this isri 2020 land cover download data we can download our data like this and you can download any part of the old you can download any part of the old data from here and it is very accurate to uh, you can measure the accuracy of this data to after downloading you can use several accuracy testing method to and you can check your data and you can verify data in, but i will suggest it it is uh, i like it very much i will recommend you to use it and now i will take you to the rgis part after downloading the data and i have a data of this region downloaded you can see it here simply and you can see it here it will appear like this and you can simply insert the nepal map to over here uh you can simply go with the nepal outline map sorry uh nepal outline map and you can see it here our map look like this and our country data uh we looks like this on the tiles we have downloaded and you can see it this is our data and you can now merge this to data and extract the country parts only and after extracting the country part only it will look like this as i have already extracted and if you need data which we have used in this video you can simply uh, comment down on the video we can provide it uh, through the uh, drive link you can simply uncheck this uncheck this and you can see it here you can simply go to zoom to layer and you can see it here we can get our country data like this after all processing or the finishing and clipping extracting all process here now with this we have come to the end part of this video as i have already mentioned if you need any types of data which we have used in this video you can simply comment down we will provide it through the drive link so now with this i am going to end the end of video here thank you keep watching